Hello and uh, welcome to laser etching. This uh, morning we want to look at etching some laser uh, acrylic and what we're going to do is put in position a uh, piece of uh, quarter inch plastic acrylic and what we're doing now is we're peeling off uh, the paper backing uh, that's on top of the acrylic and we're going to leave the bottom side of the acrylic with the paper on and we're just taking this paper off so that we can get a nice laserable etch on top of the uh, uh, clear acrylic and what we're going to do is we're going to shine it with a uh, uh, an edge lighting it's going to light up like a bright neon sign uh, we also have some uh, vacuum holes that are going to be pulling uh, any fumes, any dust, right down into the bed of the table. And that works really good once we start etching. We're going to hit go here. Now the machine's starting to move. It's going to come into uh, position. And once it's in position, we're going to set the focal height. And then we'll get a nice fine spot. We're going to put a little small spacer underneath the nozzle and drop the head down and tighten it back up again. Now when we hit go here, we're going to be traveling at uh, 100 inches per second, which is uh, not quite um, a full speed, but uh, we're probably about three quarters of, of full speed here. So we can go you know, quite a bit faster yet. This is a high speed engraving laser machine by Kern lasers. Uh, we have uh, several Kern lasers in our shop here uh, that do all kinds of different things. Right now we uh, we have moved uh, to the cutting of the YouTube sign. Uh, we just picked YouTube as a, uh, a logo. We can put uh, photographs, we can put lettering, uh, we can put uh, all kinds of uh, pictures, logos, artwork uh, etched onto the acrylic. Uh, we're cutting through this quarter inch acrylic fairly fast as you can see the uh, the bright orange light and it's uh, a honeycomb aluminum honeycomb bed that it's sitting on top of so uh, nothing is getting cut underneath all the smoke all the fume is just getting sucked up into the table uh, there's a little bit of debris on the nozzle uh, because there's very low air pressure and that's okay the laser is doing uh, just fine cutting right through the nozzle there. Uh, now we're going to pick up the piece, show you what the completed, we have a small piece and a large piece of this YouTube sign, LED edge lit sign. We're wiping off the, uh, the little bit of dust that's accumulated from the laser etching. And I'll pick these up and show you what it looks like after they're laser cut. Again, we got paper on the back side, and I'll peel that off here to show you uh, what the finished end result of the laser etching looks like. Takes just a couple minutes to laser etch this and cut out your product. If you put something dark in the background, you can see the nice contrast from the etch. Next, what we'll do is we're going to go into the office. We're going to put uh, the attach the uh, edge lighting to this and turn the light on and see how bright. Here we have the strip attached. This is a 24 inch strip. We also have a 12 inch strip that has uh, both LED lights. You can see one's blue and the other smaller one has colored uh, LEDs in it. Nice bright blue light. Again, it's a very small strip that just snaps onto the top of the quarter inch acrylic. And I'll show you by taking off the strip, the LED strip, I'll just peel it off.
Uh, you could snap this onto the bottom or the base, or you could hang it and snap it to the top if you're making a sign. Uh, but uh, this would work very nice for sign making, nice bright lights that people can see at nighttime. Store windows, storefronts uh, in the shopping malls, uh, in your home, in your garage, in your shop. It's very quick and easy to do. It's just laser engrave or etch something, put a nice bright LED strip on it, and it's very similar to a neon sign. Here's our smaller YouTube sign we just got done making. And we're going to peel off the paper on that as well. Just turn it over to the back side. See if we can get a corner started. Get that adhesive paper off the back side of it. Now you can also edge light glass as well. Uh, it's just a little more convenient to do clear acrylic. Both work equally well. When the laser cuts, it makes a nice fire polished edge. And so the light can transfer right down into the clear acrylic. And whatever the light hits, that's uh, not clear like the laser etching, it'll turn a nice bright uh, contrasting color. And you can buy these edge lighting in uh, different colors, your red, white, blue, orange and pinks, or else you can get a, a multiple multiple strips that uh, vary the colors. Uh, some of them have remote controls with them. But it's nice, they use very little power, uh, very little electrical consumption. Nice little business you could start by just mass producing um, signs, LED signs, edge lit. So, YouTube, if you're interested, we have signs avail available just for you. Um, you can see the light transferring right down the edge. If you wanted to cut some holes in it for mounting purposes, the laser is very easy to do. The Kern laser works very well. Kern electronics and lasers uh, can produce uh, 3D edge lit signs as well. Uh, these right here are 2D, just a surface etching, but the Kern laser has excellent 3D capabilities as well. Uh, not in just acrylic, but in woods, uh, as well as it can cut metal, and so you can make uh, some nice signs, whether you're doing plastic, metal, wood, So there we have it, uh, laser etching 101 on uh, laser engraving signs.